Somerville High has long been known for talent in athletics. My grandma was the most athletic in the class of 51. In 2023, Yannick Smith may be in a class of his own. He's the face of our program. I mean, he's the face of the athletic department. The school's drawn to him. He's got a lot of charisma, big personality, and a lot of game to back it up. The reigning 5A player of the year on the hardwood, Smith doubles as the Green Wave's biggest threat on the gridiron. That's something I grew up on. It was always in my genes. Everybody in my family plays sports, so I just had to follow the genes. I was touching a basketball and a football since I was a little kid. His head coach in football, Ian Rafferty, played on Sundays and says Yannick gets it, not just on Friday nights. He loves to compete. Uh, anytime they're keeping score, he, he's trying to win. Uh, he understands what it takes to, to be really successful and the hard work you have to put in, uh, not only on the practice field, but in the weight room. As special a talent, three is at both. The two sports feed off each other. When I do my releases in football, I basically think of like crossovers and under the legs and stuff in basketball. And then when I high point the ball, I just think of it as a rebound. When you think of two sports standouts at the Ville, this century, you think of A.J. Green. Smith has a little more time in the green and gold and could leave his mark among the all-time best. There are some big-time athletes that have played here, a lot of NFL jerseys hanging down there. But I think he stacks right up there, especially when you talk about multiple sports. Every time I play on Friday, I keep a chip on my shoulder. I don't let nobody knock me down. Every rep, I try to win every rep. And like his attire, Yannick Smith is the face that runs the place at Somerville High. As the grandson of a Green Wave grad, Dan Fanning, News 2 Sports.